Delve into the captivating story of the Petrolona Man, an ancient skull dating back 700,000 years, unearthed in a Greek cave, which defies conventional wisdom on human evolution. Wrapped in a cloak of controversy, political obstacles, and a mysterious disappearance, this ancient puzzle calls into question the prevailing out-of-Africa narrative. Hidden within the intricate recesses of a cave in northern Greece, a perplexing archaeological find emerges, shaking the very bedrock of our understanding of human evolutionary history. The unearthing of the Petrolona Man skull, with its distinct European characteristics, shattered long-standing beliefs, igniting debates and controversies that resonated throughout the global scientific community. In 1959, the sudden appearance of the Petrolona Man, marked by its unmistakable European features, cast a shadow of uncertainty over the dominant out-of-Africa theory, which posited Africa as the exclusive cradle of modern human origins. Dr. Eris Pulianos, a renowned anthropologist, introduced an alternative narrative, proposing an autonomous development of humans within the European continent, heralding a paradigm shift in the discourse on human evolution. Despite initial disputes from German researchers in 1964, subsequent analyses authenticated the skull's age, causing seismic waves in the scientific community. The cave's abundant repository, including fossils of diverse species and a perplexing calcified tibia, challenged established perspectives, fostering a more nuanced understanding of human evolution that transcends traditional theories. Nonetheless, the expedition to unravel this historical enigma faced severe political hindrances, leading to an abrupt halt in excavations for over a decade, which stifled the progress of essential scientific exploration. The Petrolona remains, displaying a complex blend of traits from Homo erectus, Neanderthals, and modern humans, remained a point of fierce contention, with Dr. Pulianos's findings marginalized in the face of political interference. The disconcerting turn of events in 2012, marked by an assault on Dr. Pulianos and his team, culminated in the bewildering disappearance of the Petrolona Man's skull, casting an enduring shroud of mystery and intrigue over this ancient archaeological wonder that endures to this day. The saga of the Petrolona Man continues to defy the established conventions of human evolutionary history, compelling us to re-examine the traditional comprehension of our ancient origins. Despite the obstacles and controversies, the pursuit of uncovering the truth behind this enigmatic relic serves as an enduring testament to the resilience of scientific inquiry and the enduring fascination of the enigmas woven into our evolutionary past. The Petrolona Man, with its contentious legacy and lingering enigmas, epitomizes the intricate fabric of human evolution. Its discovery in a Greek cave persistently challenges established theories, encouraging us to delve deeper into the intricacies of our ancient past and to embrace the profound uncertainties that underscore the mysterious journey of human evolution. The cave and museum closed their doors on January 1, 2019, embarking on a renovation project aimed at enhancing their significance, modernizing the facilities, and ensuring accessibility for visitors with mobility impairments. Inside the cave, a magnificent display of enormous stalagmites and stalactites greets visitors. To reach Petrolona Cave, visitors pass through an artificial tunnel and follow a roughly 300-meter-long path that winds through its primary chambers, where the splendid stalagmites create a mesmerizing spectacle. The ancient entrance to the cave, once a circular opening in the roof of a vast hall through which people and animals entered and exited for countless millennia, is now sealed. Over the years, stones and earth falling from this opening accumulated to form a substantial cone, eventually blocking the entrance entirely. Excavations conducted within the cave, initially by the Aristotle University of Thessaloniki and subsequently by the Anthropological Society of Greece, have yielded a wealth of findings from the Paleolithic Age. The findings from the Petroloma Cave date back to the Chibanian Age, approximately 600,000 to 300,000 years ago. This designation places the cave among the earliest archaeological sites in Europe. During this period, the cave served as a shelter for both humans and carnivorous animals. It's important to note that humans and carnivores did not coexist in the cave simultaneously but alternated over the ages. 
The bones discovered within the cave, remnants of animals that were consumed by its Paleolithic inhabitants, offer insights into their hunting skills and dietary habits. Additionally, the stone tools found at the site provide evidence of the technological and material culture of its ancient occupants. After humans ceased to inhabit the cave, it became a shelter for carnivorous animals who brought their prey inside, leaving behind numerous remains, primarily the bones of herbivorous animals. Carnivores also frequently perished within the cave, accounting for the substantial quantity of bones found, which now serve as invaluable sources of information about the fauna and the environment of those ancient periods. A selection of these discoveries is on display at the Anthropological Museum of Petrolona, conveniently located on site. Explore world history, spanning from ancient eras to the present day, on the History Unveiled channel. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and sharing it. We look forward to your return.